What is up, guys? It is Vaguely Vague here, and I'm bringing you uh, the third episode of my front, totally from scratch series. So, what I'm going to showing you guys today is the plant pot method. This method is completely underrated. I don't think I've ever seen anyone use it. I figured this out uh, when I was, I think I was farming on my uh, main account. Uh, I was going through my farming run, and I just wanted to fill up my plant pots because I thought they were kind of expensive, like 300 GP each. And, you know what, I was like, I'm going to price check these. They are 8 GP for the unfilled ones, and like 200 or something for like the, the filled ones. I mean, and that's crazy. This requires nothing besides the plant pots itself. No skills, no quests, nothing. It's, it's beautiful. So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to exchange over here buy me some plant pots and now there's two or three actually that I'm fired but out of these two just get the one that doesn't have any dirt in it as you can kind of see here I'm just gonna get a hundred buy them up there's no big deal if you don't can't get them for the... alright actually you know while I'm at it just to see what range I should keep it in I'm gonna get some plant Hot with the dirt, just gonna see how much it costs. Two seventy three. That's beautiful. So plant pot. Okay. So let me get fifty. And I think I'm gonna buy them for sixty two GP each. Okay, next. Nice. Yeah, that's fine, because I'm banking here anyways. Alright, so after you got your full inventory, I'm going to time how long it takes to go from our bank right here, which is the Grand Exchange, so it means you can buy more whenever you want, to said farming patch. Alright. Oop, let's go. Don't want that. Ready? See my stopwatch? Uh, I'm going to start it. Ready, set, go. Alright, so from the Grand Exchange, you're going to want... We run. Uh, sorry about that lag. You want to go east and southeast. So first running north to get around this little wall. Then you're going to run east and then straight south. Uh, south of the castle. Just don't go all the way out of the, like the walls of the castle. Just don't go inside the castle. You're gonna see this little shovel here and a little square. That's the farming patch. So you're gonna want to use this plant pot on the patch and oh fuck you gotta weed it alright now you use it on there alright now you wait so while I am AFKing which as I didn't say before, this guy, this money making guide or method is completely AFK. Like, I mean, my hands are off the keyboard. You can't see my hands, but they are not on the keyboard. My mouse is over to the side of me. I am not touching anything. I'm just watching my guy fill up plant pots. So it's completely AFK. I mean, minus banking trips, but it takes about a minute, maybe even more than that, to fill up a full inventory. So you got a lot of AFK time. You can be playing like COD or. Diablo or World of Warcraft while you're doing this, it doesn't matter. Alright, and so, um, since last video, I have gotten all my melee stats 20, except for strength up to 23 and constitution because, well, I, I don't know. I should really get that up to 23, I mean, I only got 10 XP left. I got my range up to 10, and I haven't trained my mage or prayer yet because at my levels are vaguely useless. Um, I got my hunter to 15, I'm not sure if I mentioned that. I got my fishing to 15, cooking to 10, and those are the only main changes. Oh, I got my fletching to level 2. Hell yeah. Alright. So, I'm almost done. I'm just going to count the time to run all the way back to the bank also, because it's kind of useless to just fill them up and then not even run to the bank. So, I shouldn't count the banking time also. Right, let's go. So just do the inverse of how you got here. Run west instead of east. North instead of south. And then west. 
and the BFG. If you want to bring weight reducing gear, wicked, agile, uh, boots of lightness, tennis gloves, uh, it doesn't matter. Let's check the price of this. Oh shit, I should probably turn the stopwatch off. Alright, so 2 minutes 56 seconds. If you take the weeding time off, and the time is wasted there, I'd say that took me about 2 minutes 45 seconds. Which is pretty decent. I've had better runs though. Alright, so, as you can see, this is the money that you get from 28 filled plant pots. That's 7,600 GP. So let me bring my calculator in here. If that took, run took me 2 minutes 40 seconds, we'll just round up to 3 minutes considering if it being like, I don't know. So that's 20 trips in 1 hour, depending on how fast you're going. This is slow. Just keep that in mind. So, 20 times 7,644. That is 152k going slow. I've pulled off trips where I made 300k an hour. This requires nothing. It's AFK. I don't know why you wouldn't want to do this. Now, let's just see how fast they sell. I'm assuming they sell quick, although I haven't done this method in a while. So, let's see. Put them all in, so I'm a little bit down. Nope. We'll end the sell just because, you know. Right, what's up, guys? We're back. And they sold 5% down in the GE. 7,252K. I got my other plant pots right here. Boom. All right. Now, I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to rate, comment, like, subscribe. And I think my next vid is not going to be part of my From Scratch series. I think I'm going to be making um, just a money-making guide on my main account. I think that'd be a good thing to make just for you guys that aren't liking these like 300k profit guides. I think I'm going to throw something pretty big in there. Like a mill profit. I don't really want to give away my ideas. And maybe I'll even throw out my no prayer potion barrows guide. Not a lot of people know about that. And I'll throw that in. So, again, thank you guys for watching. Rate, like, comment, subscribe, favorite, tell your friends. Alright. Bye, guys.